Nice. Sound at all? Oh, you must be the new battle trainer I've been hearing all about. All right, so it does something in the beginning. Did not know that. Hello and welcome back. It's a new week, new game. This week's game is Pokin DX. So when I went to the Level Up Expo out here in Las Vegas, they had arcane cap arcade cabinets for people to play games on, and I saw a fighting Pokemon game. And I thought, wow, that looks really cool. And then I seen it was like a Japanese style arcade cabinet and everything was in Japanese. And I was like, oh, okay, this must be an exclusive thing that's only available in Japan. Wrong! Not only is it not available, not only is it available outside of Japan, it was available on the Wii U. So I got excited. I purchased a Wii U. And as I was purchasing, the Wii U and was getting ready to check out with Pokin. The person who worked at the store said, Oh, they remade this game for the Switch. So I put the one on the Wii U back, still bought the console though, and ordered uh, this on the Switch. Right away, I had to go get a physical copy of Pokin because it is Tekken Pokemon fighting game, and I am all about that. So I definitely had to purchase this game, have to play this game. And instead of playing it off stream, like I normally would do with some console games, I was like, we'll do this as the new week, new game, because Flog Dog was with me. He saw that same arcade cabinet. He was disappointed because he also thought only in Japan, Japanese exclusives, they get all the great stuff. I get it. I know that feeling. And sometimes, yeah, I do feel the same way. Most of the times. Okay, all the time. So many flavors of Kit Kats over there. I'm jealous. But hey, this one, we got, we get a little taste. We get to try it. So without further ado, let's get in the game and listen to what Nia has to say. Hey, nice to meet you. You too. I'm Nia. Hi, Nia. I'm one of the battle trainers here in Ferrum. That's great. I don't know where Ferrum is. There's lots to see around here, mm. but don't worry. I'll make sure you know your way around. I'm, I appreciate it. I battle alongside my trusty partner, Weavile. Have you ever seen a Pokemon this cute? I doubt it. Nah, this is just cute, Weavile. <laughs> huh? He was just sleeping over there, but where did he go? Pick it up by a bird, Pokemon. I'll introduce you guys some other time. Right then, first things first. Welcome to the Ferrum Battle. Working as one with your partner Pokemon and facing off in intense one-on-one -on -one battles is what makes Ferrum Battles great. Oh, you don't but say. But first, you'll need this to get started as a battle trainer. Here's your battle AR. Ooh. Is it like a staff? When you wear this, and you'll will. be able to synergize with your Pokemon in battle. Where do I put it? Your battle AR uses something called a Synergy Stone. Uh -huh. There's actually a lot we don't know about them. That's true. But hey, we'll get into the details later. Uh -huh. Make sure you take care of it. Yep, putting in my bag with everything else. So exciting thinking about the brand new journey you're just starting out on. Me too, I'm just I'm holding back so much enthusiasm. To what sort of trainer you turn out to be. Uh, good one. I'll give you whatever assistance I can, so just try to have some fun out there. Uh-huh. Right then, let's get you registered. Yeah, oh, reg registered for You'll what? You'll be able to change your partner Pokemon later. For now, oh. choose whichever one feels right for you. All right, I'll do that. I'll do that. Set my name. Three characters, that's all we need. Uh, mail. There we go, like radioactive white. That seems about right. And then which face? We're gonna have the Brock face. And one of these, just eyes closed, mouth open. Little cat meow mouth. Serious face. Serious, serious face. Surprised face. Huh? 
You get the surprise Pikachu face? How about the cocky face? Like, <laughs> yeah. I know I'm the greatest. That's what we're going with. Uh, blue. You're blue eyed. Hold it. How does it say blondie? Silk. Changing my eyebrows too. Blondie it is. I'm gonna change the hairstyle. Oh nice, look at all this. We got a couple that are locked. Downloaded a bullet content can be purchased. Okay, so A to get these guys. Let's check out who we have. We get Dark Rye. Blaziken. Pikachu, of course gotta have Pikachu. Lucario. Is it Gardever? Godever? Lady Godiver. Pikachu Libre. Scizor. Empoleon. Empoleon. Oh, yeah. Empoleon Emperor. Braxian. Machamp. Of course, he's meant to be in this fighting game. Uh, Decidui. Dis Decidui. Gengar. Septile. Septile. Oh. Uh. Krogunk, a Mewtwo, Chandler, Chan Chandler, Suicune, Weevil. Now it's her her partner was a Weevil. All right, Charizard, Garchomp, and Shadow Mewtwo. Oh man. Um. You know I think I'm gonna go with Gengar. We will start with Gengar. You selected this Pokemon as your partner. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. This is the Farum region, where we are now. It's a Turn huge the island a surrounded by nothing but the ocean itself. Uh. Farum battles are super popular here, if you hadn't already guessed. I had it. The types of battles differ a bit from city to city, so I'll just give you the short and sweet version. Please do. To start off, right now we're here in Old Ferrum Town. Mm -hmm. It's also known as My Town, and here you can check your battle data and change your settings, stuff like that. Oh boy. Don't worry, whenever we head to a new area, I'll give you the rundown. I've got your back. Oh, I'm so glad I'm gonna have a tutorial following me the whole way. Next up is right great. here, Ferrum Stadium. Mm -hmm. This is where the Ferrum League is held. Ooh, Ferrum League. This is a single player mode where you battle your way to victory in the official league. Awesome. Next up is Teller Town, I suppose. Here you can join in casual matches against CPU opponents. Ooh. Did you hear? There have no. been some strange battles going on at the haunted house recently. Oh. Do you think it's because of those rumors saying that you'll get something nice if you battle there? That would be my guess, yeah. Check it out if you're interested. All right. When you want to battle against your friends, you should head over to Selen Island. <laughs> want to do things with your friends? Get off the main continent and go to that island. There, you can battle using two controllers. You can go hide your shame you from the rest of the continent. If you want to battle nearby friends, you can also use local communication. Head to Thalia Beach if you want to give it a go. You guys really don't like friendship. And then there's Neo City, where you can battle against Neo. online players from around the globe. Curious if there's still people playing you this check game. check out battle replays here too. So the only one of its type on Switch came out in what, 2016, 2017? In Techna City, you can learn all sorts of stuff about battles and practice a bit too. I'll give you a nice little walkthrough in the tutorial. Oh boy, I can't wait. Alrighty then. Guess I went on a bit longer than planned, but huh. that should be just about everything. Wonderful. Feel free to start off wherever you want, but... Okay. but what? I think you might be best off heading to Techna City to play through the tutorial and learn the basics of Ferrum Battles. Uh... It just took me... Oh. Pokemon Tournament DX Battle Pack, Wave 1 and 2. 
Oh, they got like support Pokemon. Mega Rayquazar, Mimikyu, and support set Mew in Celeba. Also gives you Blastoise and Aegislash as battle Pokemon. Other, you get Avatar items, titles, and Nia's outfit. Avatar items, titles, and Nia's outfits. You get to like dress Nia up. You get to play Barbie Girl with Nia. How fun. Uh huh. New battle pack. Uh, battle Pokemon. Age Slash. A skilled technician that switches seamlessly between defense and offense. King Shield. Fury Cutter. Burst Attack. Underworld Ruler. New supports. Make it work ways on Mimikyu. Hooray. Uh, Pokemon turned DX Battle Pack Wave 1. And look at those outfits. Isn't that great? Doesn't that look amazing? It does. Hey, look. Blastoise. New battle Pokemon. Water Spout. Rapid Splash. Destructive Cannon. Uh, you can get these guys. All right, and look at all these fun things. Oh, they're holding a guitar. Don't you want your character to hold a guitar? And look at her outfits. Doesn't she look nice? Huh? <laughs> Don't you want people to know you are one under the sun? A ray of light. That you're you're a ray of wonderful light. You glorious bastard. No, no, gonna attend you trick me. I'll do it later. You can also view details from the Pokemon Turn DX Battle Pack from the system menu. In the Ferrum League, you can oh battle God. against battle trainers of all different levels. Thank you. I appreciate that. Maybe I just do a single battle against the CPU and learn that way. I'm going to beat my head against a wall before we go into practice and start doing a training thing. There's also an exclamation point there. and It's got me very intrigued. We're going to do this first before we do that. By the way, if you want to purchase this game for you yourself, against CPU trainers here. you can't find it at Walmart anymore, and you can't find it at GameStop. I had to get this through a third party off of eBay. I'd recommend this mode when you just want to kick back and enjoy yourself. Yeah, I like to do that. I just want to kick back and enjoy there myself. There are three different types of battle. Oh. Basic battle, extra mm -hmm. battle, and mm -hmm. team battle. Wonderful. To take part in a normal battle, select basic battle. Gotcha. In an extra battle, random boxes will appear throughout the stage. Cool. These random boxes grant a number of positive statuses. That's including great. Including HP recoveries and synergy gauge boosts. Wonderful. The color of the box indicates what kind of effect it will grant. That makes sense. Seems color coding's good. Good. But be thing careful. To do. You might end up with a negative status if you aren't so lucky. Oh no, I don't want that. The key to extra battles is to try to nab the random boxes to get the upper hand. Uh huh. And finally, we have team battles. Yeah. Here, you battle with three Pokemon in a team. What? That's crazy. At the end of a round, the trainer that has been defeated selects another Pokemon from their team to use in the next round. Neat. The trainer who first defeats all three of the opponent's Pokemon wins the battle. Sounds real fun. Each Pokemon's remaining Jesus. HP and Synergy Gauge will be carried over to the next round. Okay. So think carefully about your battle order. A little survival of the fittest challenge. I got it. Teamwork is super important. Very important. So, so important that it's super important. And don't forget to enjoy yourself. I'm trying. Really trying. Let's go do a basic battle. Just normal. Two points. One turn time off, though. We're gonna put on infinite. And, uh. Start battle with these settings. Which Pokemon are you battling with? Gengar, since that's the one I picked. Is there a random? Yeah, there it is. Just random me. Time to pick a support set. Uh, is there a random? Unless, actually, is there a ghost group? Pick other ghost Pokemon. I'm gonna say just one. Got over here. This one. I could have got Gasoline Haunter as a support set. That would be great. What do you want to do for your cheer skill? Cheer skills. Oh, God. Cheer skill. Just whimsical. The cheer effect you receive will change every round. You might win big or not. Are you feeling lucky? Sure am. Here's where you want to hold your battle. All right. Let's random it. Let's go. 15 minutes of recording so far, just not getting to fight. 
Ah, I'm a ghost Pokemon. I'm gonna beat this guy, no problem. He's got fighting techniques. You can't. I'm, I'm a ghost. You're just gonna go right through me. Come on, let's win this next one. <laughs> Nothing happened. All, All right. right Time for battle. Go show them what you're made of. Round one. Oh, just do oh. your thing. And you'll be fine. But I'm back. Come on, Weavile. You sign up. Hey, your synergy gauge is good up. If you run like these, you'll want to stay level headed. Round two. Oh, you just got a bit of lead with your Pokemon. And your opponent's synergy gauge was in green. <laughs> different than what I saw at the arcade battle. The one that we saw was like 2D. I should have given you better advice. I'll step up my game for the next one. No, please just don't give me any advice. Right, just course. let me fail. Looks like my advice is helping, huh? What did What did you just say? This rematch. We're going back. We're going to do it again. Like I said, banging our head against the wall. Dark Palacium. Yeah. All right. Go give them what for. Don't you just get all revved up before a battle? Age is already at max. I wonder what you're about. Oh, just do your thing and you'll be fine. All right. You got it. Did he even do anything? You absorb some of your opponent's synergy gauge. You enjoyed that. All right. A nice Go look. give them what for. All right, let's have some more fun for the next round too. Now then, what'll it be? Round two. Oh, all right then, let's give it a shot. Five stars. We we're doing Congrats. wonderful. Nicely done. Good work. 
Your battles are fun, even just watching. You leveled up. Pick where you want to assign your skill point. To attack. Should I rematch? Should I do another one? I don't know. Now that we're the best there ever is, I guess we should just go off and do something different. Let's go check some other things. The reason the island is covered Let's in go to battle. daily challenges. Let's see what daily challenges the rules here to there battle are. with a specific Pokemon. Keep right. checking back as it changes each day. Oh. You can receive rewards like bonus skill points from your battles here. Gotcha. It might be difficult battling with a Pokemon other than your usual partner, but it's pretty exciting too. See, this was not the game that I expected. So our battle Pokemon is uh, it's that one. Player condition is to win two or more matches in four. All right. Desudo has frenzy plants. Backward plus A is most effective when you've been back in the corner. Someone in a maid yeah. uniform. Which Pokemon do you want to tag for support? Yeah, I always cute. just go with my gut. Round one. But you just gotta believe in your Pokemon. It's your very set. All right. Now you're in dual phase. Incredible. You've already taken the lead. Okay, now it switches to two. So dual phase means it's where it goes into like. This move. Boom! Had to him throw his bone at him, to take him out. Hey, like that. Embarrassed. This July wins. If we win one more time, we win the challenge. Always play offensively. Congrats! Nicely done. We don't earn any experience with that Pokemon. Teller Town Battle Stage. Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna give them our charm. Pokemon do you want to tag for support? I always just go with my Round one. one. But first attacks are super powerful, but you can just dodge that one. Per bird. <laughs> You're starting to get the hang of it, Keep it up! 
into a fighting match. We definitely cheated. Challenge cleared. Awesome. Oh, three and My a half. Hearing seems to have worked, huh? No. No, it didn't. You can distribute the skill points you received by going to Pokemon settings in My Town. All right. Oh, Pikachu gets skills too. It didn't even do anything. Lucky you bonus! Get a Pokemon player title. Now people will know I'm a Pokemon player. We call this energy Gaia. It's something you'll only find here in the Ferrum region. Mm. Apparently, there's still a lot we don't understand about it. Is there like a story mode? Probably with my talents. Oh no, that's just through the settings. That's probably what Furion League is. It's like the story portion. Go to my town. You can Let's check your go. play data and change a number of settings here. Right. You can equip items you've obtained or change your title. Uh -huh. And you can change your battle Pokemon too. You can also view replays of your previous battles in the battle log or in saved replays. Gotcha. Replays of your previous battles against other players will be automatically recorded in the battle log. Oh boy. However, old battle uh -huh. replays will be automatically deleted. So make sure to save the ones you want to keep, okay? Sure. And in options, you can oh change God. the sound and controller settings. Okay. Be sure to give it all a try. Yep. I'll be sure to do that. Thank you so much. Uh, profile settings. Get our new title. Let's get... Why are these showing me all the locked ones? There we go, Boken player. Lucky bonus. So lucky, we're just gonna show everybody else how lucky we are. Thanks for playing with me. Can I change that? Thank you. Good night. Good morning. Bye bye. Long time no see. Good game. Hope you have a good day. Ready when you are? It's so hot out. That's. Yeah. No, that's right. That's what it is. It's so hot out. All right. Let's go back. Uh, Pokemon settings, since we got points. Skill point allocation for Pikachu. One to attack, and... We'll do your synergy. Attack shortens the charge of time for your support gauge and hit support effects. Increase the duration of synergy burst and increase the boost you get. Attack. I'll do that too. Alright, fun times. Back out of here. Let's go back. Have you been to Thalia Beach yet? 
It's oh. so beautiful there. I, I bet. I'm just gonna go check Fearum League real quick. See if this just happens All to be right. like the story. The League is about to begin. Ooh. This is an official tournament where battle trainers from all around the Ferrum region come to show off their skills. Uh -huh. Battles will be held all throughout the region and broadcast live on TV. Live? Since this is your first time, let me fill you in on it a bit. I feel like you're going to either the way. The Ferrum League is actually made up of four different leagues. Each of these has a rank requirement for participation. Mm -hmm. Everyone starts off at D rank. So you can participate in the green league. Oh, because I'm a green, gotcha. Now, as for each of the leagues, what about within them? the leagues, there are league matches in which you battle to increase your rank, and then a tournament between the top eight trainers in the league. Oh, neat. If you manage to win the tournament, you'll get the chance to take a promotion test run by the league master. Ooh, the gym leaders. And if you can pass that, you'll get a rank promotion and be allowed to continue on to the next league. Find out one of the masters like Heihachi Mishima. You're like, what? <laughs> it should go without Hang saying that the upper leagues are full of stronger and stronger battle trainers. He just goes in there and starts laying out Pokemon left and right. So, think you've got a general idea of how the system all works? Yeah, yeah. I'm sure you'll figure sure. it out as you go. So just give it a shot. Okay. Oh right. Uh -huh. I need to tell you about the mission panels. Oh, missions. We mission missions. panels contain different kinds of missions that can be completed during battle to receive rewards. Mm -hmm. Animal rewards. For example, you might be asked to successfully land a counterattack 15 times. Jesus. If you find yourself struggling to complete a mission, you can also use a bonus key to unlock it. Okay. You'll be able to complete missions as you make your way through the leagues. Check it out if you're interested. All right, first things first. Let's take on the Green League. Yeah. Isn't it exciting Oops. wondering what kind of battle trainer you'll meet next? Oh, no, I'm just giddy with Here excitement. It is, the Beginner's League. This is where everyone finds their footing. Huh? What's the matter? Nervous? Oh, yeah, butterflies. Don't sweat it. Just work your way through the league matches and make your way to the top. All right. Get good results in the league matches, and you'll climb up in rank. Battle rules, six trainer league match. Current ranking is 40, so I have to go from 40 to 8. If I, I win one, how far up do I jump? Wonder you'll face off against today. <laughs> this battle. Sport set is always a tough choice, isn't it? So we'll just stick with who we know. Okay, let's go. So just random meta too. Fight poison with poison. That's had 22 battles. Yeah. Rise from the ground. Don't you just get all revved up before a battle? I wonder what you're about. Round one. Mm -hmm. oh, just do your thing and you'll be fine. That, that battle was awesome! Can I expect some more of that for the next one? Round no! Two. Oh, just remember, the most important thing is to enjoy the battle! Synergy game, up! What if I tell just... Form to Gengar. Uh, three star bab getting nice worse battle. and worse. Going from a five star to a four star to a three and a half. Now we're at a three. So, how about it? How are you feeling after that battle? 
Oh, it feels so good. Where you want to assign your skill points. More time. Hey, we completed a path. Got mine. Awesome! You get money. What do you think of this opponent? Think you can take him? They got Gengar too. Alright, I just wanted to see what that was about. If you drop out in the middle of a league match, your results will not be saved. You still don't drop out yet. <laughs> Okay, I'll come You're back. You're only to just it. getting started. Uh, let's You're go back here. No, no. Starters, just all these lock things too. The motion test, free to battle, into the top. mission panel. We're... She's talking. I'm not really listening. What a lovely uh, what day. else haven't we checked out? We did the dailies. We did the single. We checked out fear on the course, do, local battles, and uh, wireless battles. Kind of get the idea of how that works. Practice. I'm not stepping foot in there. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and then uh, online battles where we can go and lose to people who've been playing this game a hell of a lot longer than I have. Alright, uh, not a bad game in any sense. It's different. I wasn't expecting it to have that kind of 3D movement in the beginning and then as you attack it shifts and then goes into the 2D. I like that they did something like that. I think it's cool. I think it's innovated for a fighting game. Uh, when I saw it in the arcade like at level up expo i was just picturing tekken but with pokemon that's all i had my hopes set for was that i was going to be playing a tekken game and the pokemon characters were just going to be doing tekken moves so i figured it would just be like a reskin type thing where it's like the same tekken characters reskinned as pokemon uh, i do like that it's not that though that it has Pokemon with their own unique abilities. They incorporate a way to put in the attacks that Pokemon do into a fighting style. And the fact too that you've got Pokemon that you wouldn't expect to be in a fighting game. Like the, the Chandelier. I, hmm. Like in, in fighting games, I would think more of the fighter type Pokemon. Like Machamp is an obvious choice. Uh, throw. I would think that Hitmonlee, Hitmonchan, just those, the fighting Pokemon, that's what they do. So I was expecting to have like those. I would love to have like a, a Hitmonlee who kind of fights like Chun-Li or something. I know Chun-Li is not a Tekken character. I get it, but a rapid kicks is still a cool thing. Or Hitmonchan, you have a boxer in there. Going in there, or Hitmontop. Hitmontop could have been like your uh, Capoeira Eddie, G Eddie Gordo character. That would have been lovely, but uh, that's fine. It's it's good the way that it is. I like it. It's unique. I want to get to use some of the other Pokemon and kind of understand how their attacks work. I do see that there was like a kind of trifecta of like power. Just if I go here, I can better explain it. I start with these heads. It's fine. Which Pokemon are you battling? But you can see right where it says technical. Speed, speed, standard, power. So it's not a paper, rock, scissors. There's four of them. Speed, power, technical, standard. Standard, I think, is probably just going to be like your all around type. Yeah, there's nobody else with anything else here. Those are power, that's a type. Um, that, uh, yeah, that's. I like that there's different types. So there's clearly different ways to battle them. Uh, the leveling up system, I'm a little iffy on how that plays out, how that works. I get that you're powering certain aspects of it, and I guess it's really to be more of your play style. Which makes me think, what's the purpose of having standard power, speed, and technical on the Pokemon if everyone's little abilities things just kind of start at the same and then you pick and choose how it goes. I feel like they should have had a bit of a different start based on what Pokemon it was, how their fighting style is, and it should kind of garner more on how you play as that Pokemon as like versus you going in and changing the stats to fit your play style instead uh, having you adapt to however that Pokemon plays. I don't know if that really makes sense to people as I'm explaining it. I'm kind of a little <laughs> iffy on it too. Uh, the way I'm thinking about it is just like, I feel like the, the point system 
is is odd. Because if I just put every single point into attack, does that just mean every time I do a basic attack, I'm just going to be hitting harder than Ma Champ at some point? If someone decided to put it more into synergy and it's just a synergy based Ma Champ who's going to just be focusing on those types of things. So, uh, I mean, hopefully that, that makes some sense. But all in all, I think it's a good game. I was trying to go back. I wasn't trying to select anybody. And uh, I look forward to playing more of it. I'm going to get the DLC pack too and give Blastoise uh, a round or try because I think that'd be really cool. The guy at the store really like sold this game to me about how excited he was. He was more excited about like the, the Wii U version and I believe they both play the same. Now I'm curious and I kind of want to buy the Wii U version of Pokin and uh, see if it plays the same way. Or if maybe that's the one that we saw the arcade cabinet for and it wasn't DX here. But that is going to do it for me. Thank you all In the theorem, for you watching. Can battle against battle trainers of all different levels. Thank you, Mia. Appreciate it. Thank you all for watching. And I'll see you in the next game. Goodbye.